your baby Q not getting up to temperature, I'm going to show you a quick, easy repair and how to install it. So what we'll do is jump straight into it. Hi Weber fans, welcome back to the channel. Don't forget everything you use in my video today, there are links in the description below for the best place to get your Weber products. So what we'll do is dive into today's video. All right, so over a few weeks, I've noticed the temperature on my Q has dropped down to around 150 degrees. Now, if you have any problems with this, I'll first try cleaning the burner out. If it's not the burner, then the regulator's gone on it. What you do is you either look for one online, or if you're under warranty with Weber, you can contact them and they will replace it for free. And this includes free postage as well. So they'll post it out fully assembled and it's pretty easy to fit. So today we're gonna to be changing the hose and regulator on the Q1200. So what we'll do is dive straight into it. So what we've got is a baby Q. So I've gone through the normal process. I've cleaned all the burner, washed it out. I'm still getting a very small flame and it's sitting around 150 degrees. So I contacted Weber and what they've done is sent me out a hose and regulator. This is what, how it comes. It comes in the box and you get it as one piece. Now if you're in the States, I'll probably just send you out that piece there which obviously connects to your two pound gas bottle. But if you've got the actual hose as well, for your nine pound gas bottle, this is what you will receive in the box. So what we'll do is dive in and start taking it apart. Now don't forget everything you use in my video today, there are links in the description below for the best place to get your Weber products, so make sure you check those out. So as you can see, that was a really easy repair to do. All you need was a slotted screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, and a 17 mm spanner. Now as you can see, you get fantastic warranty with Weber. Again, this was a warranty repair. They literally send it out probably the next day, as soon as you email them, let them know, send them photos of what the problem is, they will diagnose it, and they will send you the part that you need. So again, those who are new to the channel, if you find you're getting value out of this content, then contemplate showing support by slapping that subscribe button, it's absolutely free. Ding that bell for notifications so you don't miss any coming episodes. Give us a big thumbs up and comment down below. I will reply to the comment, and if you like what you comment, I'll pin it to the video. So what we'll do is cut any bloopers, and I'll catch you in the next one.